Well, kids, family, and staff at the Detroit Waldorf School have been busy knitting scarves, hats, and other supplies for families in need. This morning, we are learning more about their cause from some people working to make a difference this winter season. Very quickly, everyone go down the line and say your name. I'm Charis Calendar Sumner. I'm Jade Abner Gilmore. I'm Blue Borromeo. I'm Kona Kale. All right, so talk to me about this initiative. What are you ladies doing? Um, so we do an annual volunteer service mm -hmm. at Detroit Waldorf School mm -hmm. um, to help those in need, uh, specifically on Martin Luther King Day. And what are you making? Um, I'm making a headband, so just to stay warm. Yeah. For your hat. I'm also making a headband. Uh-huh. And you? What are you working well, on? Well, I work at COT, so okay. I'm the one that they're partnering with to volunteer and drop off the donations. So why is this something that's so important? One, to get the kids involved, but also, I mean, it really is an incredible uh, cause. And people do need to, to stay warm, especially now. It, it's um, a great cause because one of the things that we focus on now at COTS is that we serve families. Mm -hmm. So to have their peers come in and not only serve them meals, but to be able to drop off stuff for them as well that will help them through this winter season is absolutely amazing. And not only just with this initiative, but throughout the year, what's the reaction that you see when people make donations like this? They absolutely love it, especially mm -hmm. coming off the holiday season. We have our families that were just in tears from the outpour of love that they receive from the community. Mm -hmm. So to have people come in from schools and individuals and from companies, it's just amazing and they love it. Uh, tell me why you ladies wanted to get involved. Well, I think it's really important that everybody stays warm, mm -hmm. especially in the cold weather, especially in Michigan. Yeah. <laughs> so. What about you? How do you feel when you, when you finish your, your hat or your scarf and you get to give it to someone who needs it? Well, I feel great when I know someone mm -hmm. who needs this is going to get it. and yeah. What about learning how to knit? Because I said in the commercial break, I can't even use chopsticks. Yeah. I imagine it, it, it takes some real skill to get that down. Where did you learn that skill? We've learned this in handwork, mm -hmm. and I've been doing this for a long time. How long? What's a long time? How old are you? So, uh, I'm 12. Oh, okay. So maybe what? <laughs> five years? How long have you been knitting? Um, maybe since first grade. Oh, yeah, it's a long time. It's actually built into our curriculum that's at Detroit very cool. Waldorf School. Uh -huh. So it's a part of, it's, a, it's an actual subject that they have. So it's built into the curriculum to give back as well. Uh, uh, tell me just a little bit more about Waldorf School and all of the other things that you guys do. Sure, so um, we are an independent nonprofit school um, in the city of Detroit and we're celebrating our 50th year serving children in pre-K through eighth grade. Awesome, we are very grateful yes. to you all for the work that you do in the community as well. Thank, Thank you. Thank you for coming in. Thank, Thank you. you so much.